welcome to our um, Q&A video. We thought we'd do a little Q&A video because we haven't done one of these um, yet on our channel. Um, but if this is your first time on our channel watching our videos, we are Mummy I'm and Minnie Me. I'm Ava. Ava and Michelle. We Mummy. just went to watch Little Mermaid. <laughs> yeah, we've been to see Little Mermaid, which is why Ava's in a uh, dress and I'm wearing green. <laughs> Yeah, it was good, really? wasn't it? We liked yeah, it. I loved it. It was like about two hours, I think. It was quite long, but yeah, it didn't feel like it. It was good. Right, so yeah, we asked on Instagram for some questions. So some of you gave us some questions that we're going to answer now. Some are for Ava, some are for me, some are for both of us. So we'll just answer them as best we can, yeah? Right, so we're just going to work from the list down. So they might not be in any order. We have it in a little... I've got it in my... Um, um, greeting from my castle book. <laughs> yeah. Mummy's like castle book. So, first question. Top three favourite movies. Oh. So it doesn't have to be Disney. Okay. Mm, <laughs> this is already hard. I I'll know. probably I'm, say I'm the first one. I'm a pretty good answer questions like this. I would probably say the first one is The Little Mermaid, which we just watched. Because <laughs> you've just watched it. It was absolutely amazing. But... Yeah. God, this is a hard one. Even for the first one, it's hard. <laughs> um, one of my favourite movies ever is probably Titanic, but I actually can't watch it because it makes me it makes me cry too much. So I love it. Um, yeah, definitely a non-Disney one of my favourites is definitely Titanic. Even though she hasn't watched but it, it just, that long. <laughs> well, it was actually on TV not that long ago, and I watched it, and yeah. You cried. Yeah, <laughs> I still can't. I thought maybe I'm okay now. It's been a long time, but no. She it hasn't still changed. hasn't got used to <laughs> so it. So I feel like I can't watch it. But yeah, I love that. Um, my, I probably have to, I feel like, um. <laughs> it's hard, <laughs> isn't it? Know. I can't bring yeah, up films. Yeah, this is a hard one. I've liked. It changes, doesn't it? When you it watch something. It always changes. Like. I um, have always really liked the Pirates of the Caribbean films as well. I, I think probably the first one. I might have to say I have to say the Little Mermaid. What we the one that we just yeah watched. you said that but you not two more, two more. Don't have to be in any order. But yeah, okay, for me, I think one. I'll say probably the first Pirates of the Caribbean. I do like them all. Um, but yeah, I've always quite liked those films. Mummy um, loves Jack. Um, Love Jack. Oh, what else? One more. I know my I second one. I know my second one. Um, my second one is probably Matilda the Musical. Oh yeah, she yeah. did like that film. <laughs> yeah, she yeah. was. It's not really well. That it is a good. film, but we watched it at the cinema because it wasn't out. It's not out yeah. in the UK yeah. on the TV. My third one is The Great Showman. Oh yeah, I that's love... a good one actually. Love the oh, greatest showman, but it makes film. me so sad when um, well, this is I don't know his name in the film, but the cast who plays the man, Zac Afron, who, yeah. <laughs> who I don't even know his name, but when he's playing character, he he remember he goes in the um, in the fire, to save yeah the girl um the girl yeah, and that, that and that was sad when he was in the hospital yeah that, that was probably my most that sad would definitely bit. be high on my list i think as well but i think i'm gonna go for my third one this isn't any order it's just top three i think it is the aladdin live action remake oh, yeah. because i that was my favorite like we just really enjoyed little mermaid and actually i think i've enjoyed all of them but yeah, yeah. the aladdin one i love it and i could just sit and watch it on my own all sometimes day. so yeah Right, so, next question. what are your plans for the next half of the year? This is This is easy, easy, because not a lot, really. Yeah, so we're going to Disneyland Paris in July, um, and then that's it. That's all we're doing for the, the rest of this year. No more trips, because we're not renewing our annual passes, so, yeah, Disneyland Paris, but it'll be good. Um, we're going for six nights and six days this time. Um... Although you have other things planned. She, Ava's going oh. to Butlins next weekend at the time of filming this. Um, you're also going camping or glamping, I think, in the summer holidays. 
Um, yeah. And then I don't want to sleep there. That's probably it. As I don't far really want to go glamping because, like, boom. No, glamping's better than camping. Um, What's but, glamping? Yeah, that's what we're doing. You have to sleep for the rest in the middle of the year. nowhere. Right, Ava, you have a question. Okay, Ava's favourite character and why? Ooh. This changes all the time as well. <laughs> do this this video next week and it'll At probably be a different answer. First. Are we going to say Ariel? Because we've just watched Little Mermaid. No, go on. Sorry. You're wrong. Okay. Tiana. Oh, okay. Because, yeah. because, I'm using the because. Um, it's because when I dressed up as her in... Dream and Shine Bright Eyes. Dream and Shine Brighter. I dressed up as her all day. Absolutely, we love Dream and Shine Brighter. She was in it. We thought she wasn't really going to be on that stage, but she was. She went on the stage. We were near. Um, and she hugged you. And she hugged me. So, it was amazing. But what about Rapunzel? <laughs> awesome. So, Tiana is your favourite, and the reason yeah. is because of seeing her in Dream Shine Brighter when she come and hugged you. Yeah. Yeah. If you ask for that in a couple of weeks, that might change. After the next trip, that might change. <laughs> um, what is your favourite meal? So what's your favourite meal ever to eat? What's my favourite meal? Yeah, what, what's your favourite meal? Oh, I don't know. My, in Disney or not? No, just in not general. Not in Disney, okay. Um, um, I, I... You love a roast dinner. I love a roast dinner. Um, I'd say that's your favourite, isn't it? I love Toad in the Hole. <laughs> no, no, you can't say you love Toad in the Hole. You don't have Toad in the Hole. Yes, I do. I have Toad in the Hole and you have the other half with no sausages in it. Yeah, but that's still that's Toad in the Hole. That's not Toad in the Hole, that's Yorkshire pudding. Well, I, I, you <laughs> say it's Toad in the no, Hole. No, I call it that because I'm making it, but I just don't put sausages on your end because you won't eat the sausages. I do eat the sausages. So you don't eat toad in the hole. Um, but I still like it without the sausages. Um, I like pizza. No, but you one just pick one favorite. Okay, roast. Yeah, I'd say it's the roast. I would say mine. I'm trying to think. Like, if I go out, I think my favorite thing to pick out would be like a burger and chips, burger and fries. Thing. She does normally um, pick a burger when we're out. Yeah, that so I'm gonna go thing. burger and fries. Okay. <laughs> right. Best snack at Disneyland Paris. What's your favourite snack? Oh, at Paris? my favourite snack at Disneyland Paris is probably. So how do I describe this? <laughs> you know, it's like. The lollipop, but marshmallow. Um, my main silence. Had, yeah, but you haven't had <laughs> that, have you? No, but you had the marshmallow in, with chocolate covered on it, but it wasn't a lollipop. No, I'm not talking about that. No, that was ages ago. I had that. I was with no, Kevin. last time. What? That you know, I got that long chocolate. Oh, okay, meant. no, that is actually my favourite. I changed my mind. It's that one. I So, so Mummy got one, and I got, like, a lolly, and Mummy got one, and I was like, can I try a bit? And then I was like, mm, this is so yummy. And then you had another one. And then I now. had a mini one in the, like, So, it's, cake a cho it's chocolate with covered, marshmallow inside. And it's got, like, little bits on it. Yeah. Um, so and you cute. can get that from the Boardwalk Candy Palace. So would you say that's your favourite then? Yeah, I would probably say that's my favourite. Um, I my go to is usually the giant Mickey Mouse yeah, cookies from the again Boardwalk Candy Palace. Um, but I like them all. I think I like so many. The waffles are always good, aren't they? The waffles are good. Yeah. There's still a few I need to try. I still haven't had Dole Whip, so that's next on the list. I just I don't really like things like that when it's cold, so I haven't had it through winter. But I'm gonna go with the giant Mickey cookies. Okay. Okay. Favourite Disneyland Paris meal. Oh, meal, okay. So, not 
not Disney. Um, so I think Disney. so. This could be no. any a quick service, My sit down restaurant, or chicken oh. nuggets. It's <laughs> because <laughs> that's all you have. <laughs> um, mine is probably I'm probably going to say the Mickey pizzas. I love the Mickey pizzas, and I don't think I can't go without having one. So I'm going to say probably those. Those, okay. Um. Yeah. I think restaurant though, we'd probably go Pims, wouldn't we? Yeah. Both of us. Yeah, that okay. was an easy one. Favourite thing favorite thing to do in Disneyland Paris? Can I go first? Because I yes. think I know. So at the moment, my favourite thing to do is to watch Dream Which I'm Brighter. And I think, Same. I think a lot of people um, Same. would say that. But yeah, Same. At, at the moment. I do like the rides. That's obviously going to change when that goes. Oh, yeah. I love the rides. Yeah. But at the moment, my favourite thing to do, I would watch that every day. Yeah. Definitely. I could sit in front of the castle all day just watching it, I think. So, yeah. I'm going to set up. We're both saying that, are we? Yep. Okay, um, what would Ava like to do when she's older? Uh, I swear it changes all the time. But when I first was talking about when I wanted to be older, was a face painter. <laughs> yeah. And my friend... You do that at Disneyland Paris. And then my <laughs> friend Emily, she would be like, painting the hands and that <laughs> that was arm painter <laughs> arm painter um i feel like um i want to be a castle member do you <laughs> yeah. what would you do though i said that look i would be uh oh i don't know what job would you do in Disney i Park? would Lots probably be with Bringing out the characters. You want to help the characters? Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think that would be a good job. Yeah. I think I'd choose that maybe out of... No, with the characters we'll meet and greet. And... And... I think I know what you're going to say. What? Do you want me to say? See if I yeah. got it right? A dancer. In, I was going to say a dancer in Dreamshine Brighter, but obviously <laughs> that's not going to be on probably when you're older. But... Like... Well, I mean the dancers that are in the show with the characters. Yeah. <laughs> no, 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 not the ones. You're going to have to learn French. <laughs> Bonjour! <laughs> right. right, okay. Next question. Where has your love of Disney come from? Well, I'll go first. 2020. My love of Disney came from when I first ever went to Walt Disney World. So that was when I was 18. I didn't go till I was an adult. 18? <laughs> I know, you're lucky that you've been taken. Um, yeah, so I, just as soon as I went, I don't think I was overly fussed about it. Before. Obviously, we all loved the films, loved the films before that. Um, but to really love Disney, it was definitely going to Magic Kingdom, especially, I think, Disney World. Um, yeah. My answer just... is going to be about Disneyland. And then I had quite a few years of not going. And then obviously we started going in 2020. So that was Yeah, probably... that was the first But then time. I would say your love of Disney is probably since you were born. Because you had, didn't have a lot of choice. <laughs> okay. Well, yeah. But yeah, you're definitely from going to the parks in 2020 is not yeah. for you. Yeah. yeah. Um, so mine right. got reignited, I think. <laughs> what are yours and Ava's fave? favourite movies. movies so we've kind of answered this question already but i suppose we could just do i think it means disney, disney movies yeah let's just do disney movies should we do like the disney classics like cartoons yeah. cartoon ones so mine are definitely cinderella has always been a favorite um tangled and frozen 2 i love frozen 2 i okay frozen 2 is my first. Second, I'd probably say. Um. I did free, even though it didn't say free, but. I think I'm gonna say. <laughs> oh, no, I said I was gonna say something, but I did. Little Mermaid. Even though I've already said that, I have. I want to say it again. 
Little Mermaid. Beauty and the Beast is actually one of my favourites as well. And then Tangled. So, and for mine <laughs> is Little Mermaid, even though I've already said that. Tangled, and then, what did I already say? You said Frozen 2. And then Frozen 2, so, yeah. yeah. Do you have plans to go to Disney World? So, yeah. we definitely would love to go to Disney World. Um, so, we are looking into that at the moment, actually. So, when we know more or when we um, can, we will hopefully announce something. So, but yeah. We feel like it is time, so hopefully very soon. <laughs> um, as a mum, what is your top <laughs> travel tip? So, does this mean, like actually traveling for mums like <laughs> actually traveling on holiday yes or, you, or while you're there traveling for traveling see i have really only well no no i have done it when you were younger but on my own i've only done it when you were six make them carry if they're old enough make them carry their own stuff <laughs> She always makes... I have to carry a whole so, suitcase. So, <laughs> so she's when she was six, she still took um, a normal cabin size suitcase and she wheeled it. And she always has oh, a backpack. Yeah. Not a big backpack, like a lounge fly Something, start yeah. size or a kid's backpack um, on her back in the parks. And when we're travelling, she has her own stuff. I obviously carry more. I have the bigger suitcase. She has um, like a massive one. It's big, bigger than and me. And a big hold all, but... Um, but yeah, while you're travelling, I would just make sure there's plenty of things for them to do, like colouring. She even has a word search book. Um, iPad always comes in handy. Um, what else do you normally have? Or drawing, any little games or anything. Just plenty of things to do, really. Um, not that you always do them. Also food, sweets. <laughs> they really help. Have some sweets because when you go on holiday i just think who cares about you know what you should and shouldn't eat who um, cares about vegetables <laughs> um yeah, yeah. So always make sure there's some food and sweets and things to do that and, i like to yeah do. try not to stress yourself out too much go with the flow um but yeah i would just if, if they're old enough to carry with. their stuff let them carry it um yeah, I think that's it really. If they have a bag and a suitcase, normally I, oh, they've got a coat on, I would normally put my coat on my suitcase and my bag on my suitcase. Because yeah. it's just, it, like, if it hurts. It's on top of the handle, too. don't you? Yeah, and it, it just really helps, yeah. <laughs> Go that's my tip child later. top tip. <laughs> Ava's favourite thing about Disneyland Paris. Oh, why does it always have to be about me? Um... I think. What do you love the my, most about going there? Don't think about anything that's just on now, but the place in general. Okay. Um. Is it the look of the park? Is it? The I certain think rides? it's the rides shows. and the shows. It's just all amazing. Everything. <laughs> Everything. Yeah. It's all amazing. I know this question was aimed at Ava, but for me, I think Disneyland Paris. Compared to like Disney World, I've been to California, but I don't really remember that much because we only went for a day, even though I've been there more a recent day. than Florida. But it's just so pretty. That's what I think, Disneyland Paris. I know you haven't got a comparison yet, but walking into the park, Disneyland Park in particular, I think is just really pretty. It's just something about it, isn't there? I quite, I quite like that they're close together compared to Disney World as well. Um, but yeah. That for Disneyland Paris, for me, that's what I love. But you just love it all. Do you? Mm -hmm. I love it all. <laughs> okay, what do you do for work, Mummy? I am a personal trainer, fitness instructor. So I do, yeah, clients one on one, and I teach classes as well, fitness classes. Yeah, she's a fitness trainer. Yeah, that was an that's easy what question. I do. Uh, what do you do? Nothing. You go to school. <laughs> You're a full-time student. <laughs> <laughs> okay, do you always... You've missed one. Oh, how old is Ava? How old are you? Wait. <laughs> no, you can't take it off. Why? Because it's attached. <laughs> <laughs> that 
heavy. What does this say? Oh, it might it might be back to front on there. I am sick. I am not. <laughs> No, I'm joking. I'm nine years old. Nine. So at the time of filming this, she's nine. If you're watching this in like a year's time, she'll be ten. Yeah, I'll be ten. <laughs> I'll be ten in May. Yeah. Yep, so yeah. Just nine. Okay, do you always do tricks just you two? So just us two? No. Only one time. Well, basically all the time, but except Not, for most one of the time. time. It is just Well, us. one time Only Disney, we went though. We've not with... been anywhere else, just the two of us. No. But, um, you've probably seen them in the video. We, I would do Grandma that. Grandma and Granddad. Go. Well, we've we had, like, that. nights away to <coughs> London and Windsor. We've... It's no. normally us two, but sometimes... But... Grandma and Granddad. At Disney, Grandma and Granddad. And you obviously go away with your dad. Yeah. As well, leave me at home on my own. Yeah. But yeah, we're happy to go just the two of us, aren't we? Mm hmm I don't think I'd have done it when she was really little, but yeah, now she's at an age where I don't have to worry about her too much. Like, we just, I don't know, just get on with it, don't we? Yeah. Favourite thing in Dream and Shine Brighter? Favourite bit in Dream and Shine Brighter, then? Oh, I don't know. I like it all. I love it all. I don't know if I have a favourite part, do you? Well, I like when they sing for Coco. Yeah, Dream that's good Coco actually. Baba, yeah. Baba, and maybe just the end, because obviously it's coming up to the big finale. Oh, Mummy literally knows when it happens. I always know when the fireworks go off, don't I? When we're listening to it at home, I'll go. <laughs> Star. Yeah, just everything about that show. Okay, Amazing. well, and maybe it. maybe the song, maybe the music the is the best thing. Other, yeah, is that all the questions ourselves. then? Yes, it is. Okay, so thank you guys for the questions. I hope that yeah. um, gives you a little more insight into us, lets you find out a little bit more about us. If you've got any more questions feel free to ask or if there's loads more questions you want to ask we could always film a part two of this video um oh, um oh by the way we did 17 questions <laughs> <laughs> um yeah so um if you want to keep an eye out of any other videos that we're going to be doing have a look on our instagram i'll put it down here mummy mummy what are we <laughs> mummy and mini me um yeah mommy plans so all of it and she doesn't that. even know we'll also obviously have our july trip vlogs coming up very soon so thanks so much for watching guys and we'll see you soon bye, bye.